Hello everyone, in this uh, video tutorial I'll show you guys how to configure your GPIO on your Penda board or bigger board or whatever board you have. It's very similar but this is especially uh, this video is especially um, designed for the Penda board user. So uh, if you want to configure or change the different uh, default setting on a given GPIO you want to start off with uh, looking at the data sheet here. This is the uh, um, uh, the short, shorter version of the uh, data sheet that you actually need but the important thing here is to identify the particular pin you, are, you want to change and this tutorial I want to change the uh, J3 pin number 4 it's the uh, primary function is called the name is MCSB SBI1 CS33 CS3 and this sec secondary function is the one that I want to change to is the to uh, GPIO 140 and here are the uh, description usage but so the thing you want to do is you want to uh, download this data sheet the more complete data sheet of the OMAP 4430 so on page uh, 3407 uh, under figure 18.6 you can uh, read the description of the various uh, uh, setting bits of the 32 bits available and the, the first three bits is where you can change the MUX mode okay so the, there are uh, seven or eight possible uh, uh, up to eight or seven I'm no, not, not sure but Probably seven or eight <laughs> uh, possible modes. So uh, you can change using the first three bits here. So and then the the fourth bit is when you want to change uh, enable the pull up option uh, to pull up or not to pull up, enable or disable that option. And then the type of pull up is up or down. Here is the fifth bit. So uh, for example you set this bit to be 1 then it's going to pull it up uh, by, uh, when, when, it when it starts and then but of course you need to enable the pull up option as well and then here's the ninth bit is the input enable bit so you want to change your GPIO into a, an input mode then you need to uh, you know uh, ch ch switch, change this bit to 1 Another thing I have uh, seen is there's another thing over here in, and also another bit called input enable and I guess uh, these two are similar but for different pad configuration uh, as you, you see here it's uh, I'm not very clear on that but so far it worked for the example I, I'm doing so just work with uh, from, from 0 to 8 or 1st bit to ninth bit that that should uh, get the job done. So so let's get started on that. So go ahead and log into your Panda board. So. Uh, First, the first tip is that if you don't want to work in the shell environment like sudo sh to uh, like this, then you need to change the ownership of uh, the directory you're trying to access. Um, I don't like to work in uh, sh because I cannot use the uh, tab to complete my uh, commands. Uh, so. I'm just going to change uh, the ownership of the stuff I'm trying to get into. So that would be a lot uh, faster, I guess. So I, 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 I uh, need to change the ownership of debug and also the uh, OMAP mux. And everything now. Let's change this. And then I need to change the. Okay, let's go ahead and and go 